Alex Fine pretty much told Diddy that he needs to move on and finally step out the closet. Let's get into it. Hi guys, I'm Lady T and welcome back to my channel. So Sean Diddy Combs made a return to music after six years with the new song title Gotta Move On featuring Bryson Tiller. On the song Diddy addressed the split from his ex singer and model Cassie. You found a new man so I gotta move on. Guess you got a new agenda with someone you barely know. I wouldn't say that you're wrong. Guess you had to move on. Diddy declared on the song. Diddy and Cassie broke up in 2018 after about a decade of dating and Cassie went on to marry trainer Alex Fine who at one point was hired to train Cassie while she was dating Diddy. They now have two daughters together. While Cassie's husband Alex Fine is now seemingly responding to Diddy with a shady LGBTQ post posting a picture from a pride event with balloons spelling love. Remember love is Diddy's new name. And that's not all he wrote. Happy Pride to all the LGBTQ plus friends. He continued, Attach is a charity that helps people who are in the closet and gotta move on along with other resources. Did he have been long rumored to be gay, bisexual and have a thing for men? Why is Diddy rapping about how he gotta move on? Four years later, as if he didn't spend the last four years banging everything that moves and building himself a rotation of women and allegedly men, I guess talking about Cassie is a cheap publicity stunt. Alex didn't throw shade. He threw the whole darn tree. Yes, he was talking about Sean Diddy, brother Love Combs. For years, it had been alleged that Diddy messed with dudes. So let us find out that Cassie been pillow talking about Puffy's pillow biting as a bottom. At first, Alex used to be the personal trainer for Diddy and then he went on to train Cassie. So there's no telling what he saw with his own personal eyes. Diddy, stop talking about Cassie and leave that married woman, mother of two beautiful girls alone. She literally sold her youth to a toxic materialistic lifestyle and controlling narcissists. Did he have a lot of nerve to still be longer for a woman he sprung along for years, wasting her time, her youth, refusing to commit, keeping him several women around while proclaiming his ex-girlfriend was his soulmate. When she was with you all those years, her light was dim. When she found herself worth, she left everything, got with Alex, and you can see her shining like a diamond. The woman is happy and be in love the right way. Was Cassie supposed to sit and wait forever? It's pathetic to see someone who qualifies for AARP membership to still be on some elf-ish. Good Alex defending and standing up for his wife. Let Diddy know that you're not scared and would defend your family. I mean, it's rude for Diddy to be making music about her at his big age as if this was his first love loss. It's even more assaulting because the situation was his fault. Diddy, you are 50 years old talking about gotta move on. To what? Your true secret desires to be with? Alright guys, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let's continue the conversation down below in the comments. Make sure to like the video and hit that subscribe button notification bell so you never miss an upload. I'm Lady T. I'll catch you the next time. Be blessed. Bye.